Hi everyone, Luca from lucasbearphotography.com and in this video I just wanted to show you what in my opinion is the best slideshow out there. Uh, now you probably know about uh, the one called Animoto which is a great platform and give you a lot of options to, uh, to make slideshow. Uh, however, it's quite expensive and quite limited on what you can do because if we look into the pricing um, range here really what you're going to want is HD quality and not HD, I don't even know if it's full HD so if it's 1080p so you kind of limit yourself to HD uh, 20 minutes, now you may want to do something longer, you don't know um, it gives you 60 different video styles which is quite good and 2000 tracks uh, which are commercially licensed which means that you are in theory allowed to um, use this music uh, on your videos, if you want to use it in YouTube, Vimeo, or, or, or other tracks like that. So it's it's okay. Now thirty dollar, thirty nine dollars a month, month is not too bad if you use it on a regular basis and if you're making money out of it. Now you need to think that when you're making slideshow, really the purpose of making slideshow is to sell them. Um, now I've been using a different company, which is called Pro Producer, a uh, Pro Show Producer, and they are excellent. So it's very very simple. So let me just show you how it works. So let's say I open this. So the first thing I want to do is click on uh, Create. So you go blank show templates. I always do the same thing. So Create. What you do add some content. So where you go is example. You this um, engagement photo should not so long ago. Uh, so what you do is you open add your pictures like that. So what you do is it has your pictures. Then what you can do is you also can add videos and actually kind of move them around and add text to it. So let me just show you. Okay, so once you've added your pictures and video, you can just kind of move them around and decide where they go. You can then add text, so for example, uh, hello. welcome. Um, then you can put it at the beginning and you can put something at the end or if you wanted something in the middle. Uh, I don't really use me the text. Uh, some people do, I don't personally do. Then what you do, you click next. You can add some music. So you go to your music library and just add the song. You can add one, two, three, as many as you want, really. Obviously, you need to take in consideration that if you have 10 pictures and you put uh, two songs which are six minutes, well, each slide may take a bit of time to get through. Uh, then you click on Next. And what it will do, it will ask you then to choose a, a visual effect. Now, what you can do to find out, just kind of do a few tries. Uh, I like impact, I like the elegance one for weddings, so let's say click impact, next, then he asks you to choose the name of your show, uh, welcome, uh, and then auto or custom on how energetic you want the show to be, so again this will depend on the number of pictures you have and it doesn't need to, to go quickly or not, and you can obviously decide on the tempo of it. Once you've done this, click create and this will then create the show and will add random um, uh, transitions and effects to it and uh, once is once you've done this it will at the moment it's doing it it will just show you um, what it's gonna be like and if you like it you can just create it, if you don't like it, you can just go back and then uh, choose another one. <clears throat> so, let's have a look here. Right, okay, I'm not going to go to the end, uh, but you can see here is obviously working in the bottom. Um, and once you've done this, you can then export it as many formats as you want. So you go Blu-ray, DVD, video for web devices and computers, so maybe iPod or iPad format, YouTube, Facebook, Vimeo, Smug Mug, uh, Show Template, uh, you also got uh, Custom, I'll show you in a second. Okay, so here what he's going to do is going to show me 
my my thing here. So there we go. We got pictures, one after one. Obviously, I didn't put any music, so there is no music in the background. But normally, there is music. Once you're happy with it, you can click next, or you can click try again, or back to kind of try something different. Uh, let's say we're happy with it, so I click next, and then click done, and then here. Tell me, I don't know why. You have all your uh, pictures with all the transition. Once you've done this, you can also sync music. So, for example, if you have one or two songs in it and it doesn't cut to the end, you can have you have this option which is synchronized music. There is no audio track. Okay, so what you will do is give you an option when you have music there to actually match the number of pictures to the music. So, for example, if the music is uh, five minutes, your picture are three minutes at the moment. What it will do is it will increase the number of time within the picture to get to that five minutes so your song will start with your picture and will end with the end of the pictures. So that's really, really good. And that's all done automatically. Once you're happy with your show, uh, you can also edit each single frame uh, fully. I actually don't have the knowledge of the what you can do with it, but it's very very professional and very advanced in what you can do I don't have the skills to do it so I try to keep it as simple as I can and quite quick as well because I don't really want to be spending I used to spend hours trying to find slideshow and making something together this is not something I want to do I want to be quick I want to be good and move on and this program really gives you this opportunity of putting everything together press the button and it does it for you once you've done it you can then publish it and I'll say you go custom video file, pro show gallery. The amount of different things you can do is ridiculous. There is no time limit. Uh, you can do in full HD, 1080p. Uh, you can uh, upload it straight to YouTube, Facebook, Vimeo, which are kind of the most common things. Uh, you can also put it onto the uh, Photodex website automatically. There is a multitude of things you can do. You can also add your watermark. So, for example, when I do a show, if I don't want, for example, to, uh, if I want to sell it, so for example, I do a session, I want to sell the show once I've done the session. What I will do is I will put a little watermark here on the side, uh, just over there. So, obviously, when I offer it to uh, the people that want to sell it, I tell them, well, you know, you can buy it in full HD without the logo, you know, so it doesn't, uh, it's not there. But this uh, this software is I'm gonna give you the price of it here. So Photodex is a company who's marketing and by your upgrade, let me see the price. Okay, it's two hundred and fifty dollars, and that's for the full version. Um, now I personally sell my slash for hundred and fifty euros or pounds when I was in UK. Now if you think that the, you sell, let's say, one or two per wedding, you, you get your money back very, very quickly. So it's a good investment. Now, what I would recommend is that if you're a bit short, buy it just before your wedding, before you do the wedding, or just before you, uh, you're about to give the picture to your clients. And what you can do is be a good surprise for you to actually show this to your clients. And, um, you know, it, it, it's... Once you see the show, it's a really, really good buying uh, method. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you uh, a video, a slideshow, which I've done not so long ago of an engagement, which is actually the picture I was uploading earlier. Uh, and just to show you about uh, how I did it and how it looks. So I did put a few videos in there. As I said, I didn't put it in text, but I could have done if I wanted to. And it literally took me, I don't know, a um, couple of minutes of a couple of minutes manually to do anything, uploading the pictures, checking that I'm happy with it, synchronizing the music with the um, with the pictures and uploading it, and that is all I've done to it. Uh, yeah, and adding a watermark for the YouTube version. But the, I've got a version which is high res without any uh, watermark, just if they wanted to buy it. So I'll show you this and. This is by far the best slideshow program I've ever used. Uh, I've, I've tried for a long time to really look for something good 
and Animoto, I wasn't too keen on the restriction, I wasn't too happy about this. Design were okay, but Animoto is getting a bit too popular, and I wanted something a bit different, where I can like, control a bit more uh, what's happening in slideshow, and this really gave me that control, plus that amazing uh, tools, you know. If you wanted to make this with uh, Photoshop, you will take weeks to do it. So, amazing software, well, well recommended. So, yeah, have a look at the show, let me know what you think, and if you have any questions, let me know. Cheers, see ya. I know I can't take one more step towards you Cause all that's waiting is regret And don't you know I'm not your ghost anymore You lost the love, I love the most I learned to live half a life And now you want me one more time And who do you think you are? Running around leaving scars Collecting a jar of hearts And tearing love apart You're gonna catch cold from the ice inside your soul so don't come back for me who do you think you are I hear you're asking all around if I am anywhere to be found but I have grown to strong Don't come back